Hi there, and welcome back, my friend, to Kingdom Come Deliverance. We're looking to help Johanka in the case of her Inquisition, and we're looking around for some documents that could give us the chance to speak to her. And uh, you can move around here. There are some documents here. I mean, should probably search that room at night. Wait, we, de we definitely. Oh, yeah, we should. Talk to him about the thugs. I'll defend her in a duel, no. Monsignor, I've heard of various irregularities in the province that might be of interest to you. Very good, my son. A good Christian certainly shouldn't conceal such things. Please, speak. Uh, yeah, that was ridiculous. Some women in Egypt went to the herbalist for magic ointment. Then they went to the woods, smeared this ointment on themselves, and engaged in all sorts of incantations and spells. What? Witchcraft? God have mercy. They must be brought to justice. Who is this herbalist they visited? Uh Not to worry, Monsignor. Father Godwin put a stop to it. Well, that's good news at least. Witchcraft will not be tolerated under any circumstances. And then um... a demon's skull was found on the church building site. Hmm, yes. I heard something about it. A disturbing report. Tell me what you know about it. It was a deception, sir. Someone made it with evil intentions to frighten people. I found the skull and brought it to the local knacker. He confirmed it was a human skull with animal horns stuck on. You did the right thing, Henry, in uncovering the deception and in telling me about it. Um. There were Valdensians hiding in Ujits. Really? And how did you find out about it? Sir Hanish sent me to help the vicar track them down and catch them. So, Sir Hanish had an interest in finding them? Yeah. Yes, that's right. I'm pleased to hear it. It's not always possible to see eye to eye with secular lords in such matters. And how did it end up with the members of the sect? They fled. The vicar is still trying to track them down. That's unfortunate. Let's hope the vicar succeeds promptly in his mission. Yeah, yeah, uh... And there's Simon. The former parish priest of Rovna, Father Simon, went missing one day. Everyone thought he'd fled from the province, but in fact he just went to the woods and became a hermit. I see. Why did he do that? I will tell his story. Because he got some girl pregnant. The child died during birth, though, and the mother too. He took it to be retribution for his sin, so he fled far from people, because he didn't feel fit to be their pastor anymore. That's very interesting indeed. Where is this Father Simon now? I tracked him down in the woods and talked him into going back to Rovna. They needed a parish priest there, and Simon was convinced taking on the task would make amends for his sin. Interesting. Father Simon's story is certainly remarkable. Whether his actions are appropriate for a cleric is another matter, of course. Thank you for telling me about this. Father Godwin, we'll not talk about Father Godwin. Talk about the in irregularities. There are interesting things going on inside the monastery. In the monastery? What kind of things? The monks in the monastery are very concerned with the election of the new abbot. There's a lot of scheming going on over it. But how do you know about it? 
How does a servant of the royal hetman come by knowledge of the confidential affairs of the Brotherhood of Monks? Uh. <laughs> I caught wind of it. I heard it from a novice that the brothers were sending out at night to buy wine for them. I see. And what was the name of this novice? Uh. Uh. Marek. Do you take me for a fool? There's no such novice at the monastery. The prior informed me that someone recently infiltrated the monastery with the aid of a letter of acceptance that didn't belong to him. And his description of the intruder fits you remarkably well. Is there anything you'd like to add, Brother Gregor? Oh, shit. But, Monsignor, it's not like that. I can explain. And indeed you will. That, I can assure you. And you'll have plenty of time for it. What? Uh. Well, that didn't work out as we wanted. My goodness. So, with that, I think we'll try to flee with Johanka, right? Six days of jail time. Hurry to the Inquisitor so you don't miss. Oh my goodness. So we faced jail time and now... Goodness, we need to eat. We have dried fruit. Uh, good horse. Freaking church. So we got Johanka killed, I'm pretty sure. Sides are shriveled up with the hunger. That's why we. Nah. Uh, move some to the halls, eh?
That's better. We eat here. That's a lot better. So Rohanka is dead, is she? My goodness. What a disaster. <laughs> oh. Where's your hunker? What happened to her? Why weren't you there, Henry? You should have been there. You abandoned her in her darkest hour when she needed you the most. Without your help, there were very few people to speak in her defense. I tried talking to the Inquisitor, but it was futile. Your hanker stuck obstinately to the truth as she saw it. She even attacked the church in court. The Inquisitor found her guilty of heresy and sentenced her to have her tongue cut out. It was too much for her. She died sleep. soon after. Just won't get any sleep. Oh shit, and Matthias is woke up now, oh, right? Matthias. He's gone too. He relapsed and succumbed to the fever. I took both their bodies to Rovna secretly and buried them in the churchyard there. As a heretic, by rights, she shouldn't be buried in hallowed ground. But it seemed the right thing to do. I pray the Lord in his infinite mercy will forgive me for it. Farewell. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Goodness. I had to get it put right after. All right. Um Yeah, let's go and uh <laughs> Put this matter behind us, eh? <sighs> what is where's the presbytery? Shit. The Ratai Presbytery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My goodness, we shouldn't have talked to the Inquisitor. Can't trust the church. That's what we've learned, and we'll act according to it. Are you still there? Yeah. Trying to cut me out. Yeah. Wow, that feels bad, eh? And all because of that freaking yeah. Inquisitor. We've trusted the wrong man. Yeah. We should have listened to Sir Sebastian. So trustworthy, that man. Still there. Yeah. He's still there. That's one of the questions I have. We need to sleep. Cut out. No. There anymore, let's try.
coming. Not really. His gun went away. Let's take them off, some of these. that. Ah. Uh, okay, it's about women. They're elevated. Some of the times. <laughs> We've trusted this Far too much now. Yeah. We have paid blood. Stalled out. Out of my way, I don't care anymore. The church, that holy thing is gone. Let's ride. Yeah. About time. Oh, well, maybe there's something. That in a show of rage we might do. Hey, what are you doing here? God. What are you up to here? Lost something? Good morning. We can talk trade. Oh, uh, the question is, can we do anything? Yeah. Face of evil. Ultimately, it's the church's fault. Can't go around and kill old people. We can try hurt the church in the, in the future. Yeah. That we will do. So, thank you for watching and happy gaming to you. 
see each other in the next episode. Have a great time until then, and happy gaming. This is one more can.